right guys welcome back to part two of our virginia tour <laughs> yes so we've been traveling through virginia we just kind of did the dc tour area great time there if you want to see that video and you missed it check it out up above but in this video we're going to talk about the jamestown yorktown williamsburg area and there is a ton to do there a ton like, we stayed a week and still didn't get everything done. All right, so the first stop we did was... Yorktown. Mm -hmm. We mm -hmm. loved going here, um, mainly because, and we've mentioned this in previous videos, we've been following the Hamilton soundtrack. Um, we yeah. haven't made it out to see the Broadway play yet, but um, the We're soundtrack... Trying. Would love to. Would love to. <laughs> but the soundtrack has really kind of painted a really good picture of that whole musical in general and one of the key songs is called Battle, Yorktown. It's the Battle of Yorktown? It's called Yorktown. York the Battle of Yorktown. 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 Yorktown was mm. amazing it was just so cool to get the visual of yeah. how far everything was and really what they were trying to accomplish and it's absolutely terrifying to yeah. think about what they were doing and to see how that kind of all laid out um yeah just terrifying it's so cool to be kind of at that that surrender point of when we won our independence yeah, well, from britain to see the river oh it's just all amazing of it played out the battle of yorktown 1781. Okay, so Keegan, what are we standing in? Like, what is this wall right here? The, it's the French battery. The French battery, yeah. So these lines were literally made for the Revolutionary War. And then you can go up this trail and you can see the British lines. So people were literally for the Revolutionary War, barricaded behind all of this, shooting the British over there. Super, super crazy. State, we're in the second Allied to down. First one's over there. The second one. And then the British down bricks over there. These are American cannons, if my uh, history serves. That's a lot by yet. Well, we don't know that for sure. That's, Mom, what, that's what we think. So that one looks like the same ones that were over. Wait, wait, it's the same color, that's for sure. Uh, seven on. Seven nine nine three. Oh, okay, so that one has four numbers on it. We know that the British cannons have three numbers that just come in their way. Okay, so for those keeping up, we are at the first battery line, I think it's, what was, anyways, so this is where all the artillery is, there's more artillery that way, but the important things of this battle line were, right there is the redoubt number 10, and then over there is redoubt number 9. Those are what we conquered with Alexander Hamilton and the French. That's what gave us then direct, basically, access to enemy lines, to the British lines, and we could fire directly into the British camp over that way. So, big key events. <laughs> so this is the field the British surrendered in the Revolutionary War.
anyway, um, so Yorktown was amazing, and in addition to Yorktown, they kind of pair it with Jamestown. They do. They're right next to each mm -hmm. other. Yeah. And so we obviously did Jamestown next, and Jamestown is the earliest English English settlement, settlement. in yeah. North America. North America? Yes. Yes. Okay. <laughs> yeah, so it's not the oldest the European settlement. That was actually St. Augustine. Mm -hmm. um, but this is the early, earliest English settlement that survived long term. There were definitely some that that started earlier, but they didn't continue and, and um, thrive, per se. So Jamestown was really fun. There's a couple of points of Jamestown. Obviously, you have the National Park. And then you have Jamestown Settlement, which mm -hmm. is very similar in setup to Plymouth Plantation. So you have a whole kind of reconstruction of the entire Jamestown Settlement with kind of their, they have ships there. The walls, the ships, the buildings. The buildings. The um, ships, I think, were the highlight. Reenactments, yeah. um, all kinds of stuff. So that was really fun. And then what else did we do while we were in Jamestown? So they have a really cool glass blowing mm -hmm. building, I think is what it's called. Yeah. The glass um, house. Glass house. And it's just fun to always kind of see, I think, that craft in general. Um, but they were showing how specifically they did it back in the day um, to kind of make those things using local materials. Yeah. Super cool. It's so fascinating. Capital in the very early days, and then they moved it to Williamsburg. Mm -hmm. So then you kind of go over to Williamsburg, big town. That's where the governor used to live. Um, actually, when Thomas Jefferson was governor, that's where he used to live. Yeah, fascinating. Um, so just this whole kind of big town where you see all the workmanship and and the craftsmen. They actually have people making crafts, uh, not crafts, but um, actual trades, trades mm -hmm. to fix buildings there, like legitimately. Yeah, um, and it was. It was just cool to see they have a, they had a live marching band come through. It was a fife and drum band. Yeah, so it would have been for the military purposes mm -hmm. back in the day. Uh, it's just kind of cool to see how all that stuff happened. They also had ago. a cannon fire go off. So Scared the crap out of them. <laughs> all of us. All of us. But it was fascinating. And um, so the kids got to actually hear that um, firsthand. So that was a lot of fun. Yeah.
Thank you all for joining us. Uh, one quick thing, I'm going to link a video up here. If you're interested in how we travel um, between each of these locations, we made a quick video about it. You can link, see it in the link above. And it just kind of shows you what the RV looks like during a travel day and how we get from one site to another. And you can kind of see some of the campsites. So definitely go check that out. All right, well, the next stop is further south as we continue down into North Carolina. Uh, I think it'll be a fun place. Yeah. Actually, I've been there a long time ago, but the kids are new. And more history. More history coming. So I'll catch you guys in that video. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time. See you next video. Bye, Bye. guys.